What's poppin'? It's KG Go Hard, and I'm back with another video. Y'all already know what y'all about to get, man. Tune in with your boy. It's about to go crazy. Be going up every day, and if you ain't like to subscribe, do so now, because it's about to jump. Hello, CSM Electronics. Uh, how you doing? Um, I'm okay. calling. Um, this is Kevin. I actually uh, got a TV there, a 75-inch. I was just checking to see what the yeah. status was of it up there today. Yeah, they're still working on it. It's, it's a part right now, so they're, they're putting the LEDs in there as we speak. Uh, we probably won't have it completed until Monday, I think. Okay. All right. Um, are you guys open on the weekend at all? No, no, we're closed on weekends. Okay. Yeah, that's the reason I was calling today, just to make sure, though, if I didn't get it today, would I be able to get it any sooner than Monday? But okay. Yeah, we, we probably won't be done testing it and everything until Monday sometime. Uh, so that's probably the earliest we'll have it ready. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. We'll all right. talk to you then. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's good, y'all? Y'all know what's poppin', man. We back at it with another one. Um, real good news today, y'all. Um, y'all see it, man. Like, y'all see it. Um, we got uh, Magic Johnson on today. Hold on, let me show y'all. Show y'all what's going on real quick. You know what I'm saying? 32, Magic Johnson on the back. You know what I'm talking about? Hold on, let y'all get the whole lick in. Hold on. The just. You know what I'm saying? Got the white sweatshirt going on. Some slight with the white. You know what I'm saying? Nah, but for real though, it look real good outside though. The weather looking just how it need to be though. We got some good news, man. Early this morning, we about to actually uh go pick up the 75 inch TV, man. You know what I'm saying? The one that was in the bedroom, um, we used to watching it that size. It's been there for a while. Um, you know, feel me? We're watching the playoffs and it just, I ain't gonna lie, just fade to black like the tent. You hear me? Just, whoo. But whatever it was, you know what I'm saying? We, we, I couldn't figure it out. I turned it off, powered it back on, did a bunch of stuff, unplugged it, plugged it back up, all of that. Nothing worked. Uh, so I had to unmount it. You feel me? I took it down off of the, uh, off the wall. Um, and I ended up, we having a, we had another TV in the box sitting in the garage. We had a, a, you know, my wife, she a couponer and she was able to find a decent sized TV. Um, man, almost five, six months ago, probably longer than that. You know what I'm saying? Um, she actually found a TV uh, for a real decent price and it's been sitting in our garage. I think it's a 50 inch. Um, we never had to use it. It's just been sitting here just in case we ever needed to use it, which was a good thing because we had to pull it out the box that night. Um, we pulled it out. It's a 50 inch. It's a uh, actually it's a uh, Amazon brand TV. It was it was called Omni. I just threw the box out too. It's crazy, but yeah, I actually had the uh, box. But the thing about it is, all the other TVs in the house, like the remotes, work on all the other TVs. By this being the only Amazon TV in the house, the actual remote to it is specific. Um, lost that thing probably like. 
two days, you know what I'm saying? Like, we probably had it up there, like, two days um, and lost the remote. I don't know where it is, you feel me? But, you know, it is on voice command, though, so we able to, you know, navigate our way through um, television or what we want to do on the TV through voice command, though. Like, if I'm in the bed and I don't feel like doing no moving, I could just... Alexa, turn on the TV. Okay. And that's cool and all, but we got Alexas like all throughout the house. So like whenever you actually like say the word Alexa, you might get five or six different Alexas that might respond. So um, it's kind of tricky with that. But, uh, you know, a lot of times you be in the bed and the TV be on or you want to change or you want it off and you just feel like, you know, you, you can't find a remote. You feel me? But if you don't want to do any, all you got to do is. Alexa, turn off the TV. And the TV off, you feel me? So that's what it is. It got its, it got its goods and its, 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 its bads, you know what I'm saying? It's pros and it's cons. But the good and the best news about all this today is, man, I fucking got heartburn. Um, it's over with. Today is the last day. We actually got confirmation today from um, CSM where I actually dropped the, uh, I just put the, t um, the air in my tires and forgot to put my cap back on my wheels because they most definitely was low. Um, on salt and pepper. I just gotta find out what wheel it was. But I think it was the front left. It's all good. I'm gonna pull it out anyway and do that. But um yeah, so um we about to go pick the TV up. Um and, and hopefully uh, everything works smooth. He said that he's gonna run some other tests. Um what actually it did happen is um he said the LEDs went out the uh, which were the lights inside the TV that light up everything. They went out, so that's the reason why I wasn't able to get any picture. He said that's a common problem with these TVs. Um, that was my first time um, learning about any TV repair at the time, you know what I mean? But, like, I learned a whole lot. If you guys haven't seen that video, please go back and go watch that because it's real educational. On top of that, when I left his uh, shop, I went to Walmart to compare prices on whether um, it's smart or not to replace the LEDs in that TV or going to Walmart and buying um, a, um, a brand new TV. We're not knowing how much you could spend it for. So we actually found out that the repair on the TV was around $300. And we want to see how much we can get for $300 around Walmart. So if you guys want to find out exactly what happened on that day, please go back and watch that video. Let's take a right there on the side. He's about to move. TV malfunctions that they just replace it. Mm -hmm. But to be honest with you, a lot of things can be fixed on. Okay. Mm -hmm. The only issue is what the cost may be if it's something that's reasonable. We try to make sure it's reasonable as much as we can. If we thought it was something that's gonna be extensive mm -hmm. or too expensive, we'll let you know it for. We're pretty honest about that. We'll I like tell that. you don't waste too much money on it. But this is happening a lot right now in the last couple of years. Most of the TVs that we're getting in now is experiencing the same thing that yours is experiencing. Mm -hmm. And where the uh, LEDs inside the screen, that's what lights your screen up. LEDs, a whole bunch of them in there, right? Mm -hmm. But some of them would have to drive them so hard because you're watching very bright, vivid pictures that tends to make the LEDs die out prematurely. Okay. See, so what happens is we have to pull them out and put a whole brand new set back inside and light that screen back up for you. And then we'll, ex we'll explain some things once we're done on how to maintain it so that uh, it doesn't do that to you again. Uh, but we'll we'll discuss that once the TV is prepared. For sure. That's happening a lot right now. We, we're doing more screen repairs now than used to be. It used to be just circuit boards and things like that. Mm -hmm. But for the last couple of years, the majority of the repairs now are because of the same problem. The screens are working out. That's real educational to me too, though. Because I actually thought maybe your number one might have been made. Is that what that's going on right there? That strip right there? Is that LED? That or that's a crack right there. We just put that up as a demonstration of what yeah. the crack looks like in the screen. If, if you hit it. Those aren't fixed. Um, that's what Other than that, today we about to go pick it up. All right, got old salt and pepper outside, man, for real. And uh, got a 
cap right there. Got a cap right there. Got a cap right there. what we missing the cap at y'all so they give us all four caps on our wheels you know what I'm saying we cleaned up let me make sure I got this cord to this TV I forgot he told me okay. there you go glad I got this because he most definitely said Ugh, to keep it and I want to keep it with the TV so that I don't be losing it, but um, whew, I'm glad I got that, though, for sure. He told me to keep the remote, too, so, I mean, the remote is in the crib. It's all good. Um, Let me get this blanket, because we do need a blanket. Excuse me. Um, I used the blanket to protect the TV when I transported it the first time, so it worked good. So, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So, I'm about to put uh, the blanket across the back. And hopefully, uh, the TV should be safe until we get it back to the crib. Let me get these boxes, right? Artist, most safest way to transport your TV but this is what I got this is what I'm doing this is what I use this would work last time so hey man if it ain't broke don't fix it if your TV is broke you make the decision on whether you want to fix it you know replace it repair it it's up to you man you are gonna see though I mean I really hope <clears throat> that once I give him this money that I'm getting a TV that's you know hopefully in better condition than brand new but if not at least brand new close to it I mean buying a TV is an investment you know what I mean I don't expect it to go out you know what I'm saying in a month two months you know I had this I had it maybe two years before it went out um yeah I don't know man let me show y'all real quick though yeah, I just showed y'all the Amazon TV. So before I pull out, I just want to let y'all see real quick the difference in size, if you guys can tell, because, I mean, I watch TV in the living room on a 75. So when I go retire to the bedroom, I want to see the same size picture. And even though a 50 inch is a blessing, you know, it's not the same. It's not, it's not what I'm talking about. So let me give y'all a visual real quick. Y'all can feel what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, just the living room. There is a difference, you feel me? But I even even here, I feel like we need a 86. I be seeing them in Walmart, you know what I'm saying? So it's time for upgrade. But to watch this right here and then, to, you know, go to the room and watch the 55. Let me show you. Then to watch the 50, or I mean 50, it ain't in the 55. So it's a difference, you'll see. Like, it's just, you know what I mean? There's a difference. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm in the bed. I'm chilling. I'm laid back trying to watch the game. You feel me? I'm on the mode. Wow, you feel me? Alexa, turn on the TV. So I'm trying to figure out why. Yeah, you feel me? That's the vibe. But, you know what I'm saying? So there is a difference. And then also, like, uh, outside of this TV, um, you know, that TV, I had to mount that one in the room as well, though, because once I took the 75 down, I needed another TV up. We mounted that. That was like my first time doing that. But my very first time ever mounting the TV at all was we mounted this one in the kitchen, which is a smaller TV. This is actually like a, um, but we put this mount on here though. You know what I'm saying? Me and my wife watched the video. I ordered this mount right here actually off of Amazon. Um, it might've even been one of the cheaper ones though, but it, you know, do everything it's supposed to do is swivel. It fold, you know what I'm saying? Like it's a good one. You know what I'm saying? Like this, a, I can do my thing. You feel me? 
or I can, you know what I'm saying, lay it flat, but maybe cleaned off or whatever, but yeah, um, that's it though. But yeah, we put that mount up there and we ain't had no issues. So I'm gonna have to probably um mount that 75 back up. Probably gonna need another set of hands, so I'll probably wait till my wife get off work. But um if not, I might be able to handle it. But let's go see it and make sure that it worked first. And then uh we can see what we got popping. But it most definitely a good day though. It's uh feeling good. Um, for those of you who didn't watch the video, I actually spent, I think it was $65 initially when I dropped the TV off because he told me that, uh, that was like the diagnostic fee pretty much for him to research the issue. So, um, that is being minus from the total that I have to pay to get, um, the TV repaired. So I think my balance now is around 250 something to yeah, around 250 something. So um, we about to find out uh, how everything turned out though. So let's get it. All right, y'all, man, it's warming up already. So most definitely gotta hop the top for sure. And then uh, if y'all, you know what I'm saying? We finna slide to Harker Heights. Um, that's where the uh, shop CSM at, man. So, I'm gonna slide out there and uh, go get our goods, man. So, uh, it's a little tight. Turn left, then the destination is on your right. All right, we pull it in. We about to actually back in where we backed in at the first day. And uh, hopefully we picking up a working TV. Park next to that clean Cadillac over there. Uh, that's where we's at, man. Pretty much where it all went down the first time, man. CSM, right across the street from uh, all that stuff over there, man. But uh, let's walk in here and see what's going on. What's going on, bro? Okay. Uh, okay. Give them 
What movie is that that's playing? Is it an older movie? Because it look all fuzzy. Is it supposed to look like that? That's whatever. Uh, which one is a high school? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, probably was just the movie that was on because it's looking yeah. decent now. Okay. That's definitely. Um, is there someone here to help me get in the car? How do I, I gotta get it? No. You can be more than welcome to use They out the office stage. There's only be somebody here. But they out. Um... Okay. Well, I'm parked in the first park. It should be all right. I got it. You park right here? From right here? No, you park right here on this end. It's way closer. It's the first park right there. Okay, but I'm gonna back in right now, real quick. Here. Okay. All right, I thought I had a decent park, but I don't know. She said that that's a little bit further than right here. So hopefully I can just get right over there. I don't know if I can pull around the side over here. I might be able to drive around. Let me see. Nope. Can't drive around, so. Man, I'm not gonna do all that. I think I got I think I got it. I think I got it. Huh. I thought I was gonna be able to drive around. I'm not gonna do that. Oh no, you gotta go out. You go out right here and then come right in. Yeah, I don't want to fight traffic. I think I got it. No, he he got traffic. I ain't finna do all that. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's it. I seen when you put the YouTube. Okay, the, YouTube the only thing, thing is, like, when you watch a movie in high definition, like, in high, high definition, when you don't watch some, what you want to watch a program in high and real high, turn it back down. Turn your city down. This is where your LEDs out. If you leave If you leave them on high, like, you know how you do, you do the screen to so the highest definition is possible mm -hmm. when you watch certain movies. I don't want really to play with it. But okay. it's not on real right now, though, right? Uh uh. Oh, okay. So you can leave the side how you got it set. Okay. But if you if you somebody come and just turn it up and you leave it up high, that's what burn your LEDs out. Okay. Mm -hmm. so, go make car tax. So car. Also the game will link to my YouTube channel too. I do YouTube, so um I'm gonna leave it with you. You can check okay. the video out uh, on the TV repair. All right, this one. Yeah. I got good reviews though, but uh, a lot of people don't know how to fix the TV or where to come though, so. Yeah, mm hmm. Yeah, for sure. When we do more TV, we do uh, dishwasher, we do stove, we do. Um, I'm so used to doing this. We call the phone, I have to sign myself. Okay, <laughs> so uh, we do. Uh, we do everything itself pretty much except for a, a refrigerator. We do microwaves, uh, stoves, uh, dishwasher, washer dryer. The movie apart. Yeah, I think you got a phone call for like a dishwasher or something when I was looking for the first time. Yeah, we do dishwashers and all this stuff too. Okay. We get a lot of people calling and asking we do games. We don't do games, so. Not yet. Or not or not or not gonna do again. We used to do computers, but uh my boss's wife, uh she started back teaching school, she wanna do the computer, so we don't do that anymore either. You got a 90 day warranty. So if it go out again and within the 90 days the part of anything, he can fix it. You just bring it back in. You don't have to get up to Okay. I shouldn't expect no other issues outside of the LEDs nope. after this though, right? Nope. Alright, perfect. You got this ain't you, you got your power for already, right? Yep, he told me to keep it, so See how to work this dowry. Look, I don't think I'm gonna get that. I want to break the TV. Can you think you can pull it Oh, out? get the cord out. Okay, that's all. I got mm -hmm. you. Yeah, no problem. Well, I got these nails. I don't want to. <laughs> uh, you want to turn it off first? Or yeah, I'm going to turn it off. Power off. Okay. 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 Okay.
You got to be in shape. You ain't in shape on how you gonna pick your TV up? Why? That must definitely was a whole workout. For sure. Look, your boy ain't playing no games, though. I got it in there, though. Woo! Secure that bag. She wants uh, the copy of the YouTube. Make sure I get that to him real quick. So, um, pull this up. write it down i ain't had nothing but i just uh this actually my channel right here if you uh kg go hard k-a-e-j-e-e -E. then i'll show you the video actually where i dropped the tv off right here that's it that's i appreciate you hitting that white subscribe on the top oh that's me first off okay I took care of that. I don't want to do no playing and no games. But well, I got this TV in this car, so oh, I'm about to make sure I get this thing to the crib safely. Um, that's crazy, man. I don't know how you gonna move your joint if you ain't. I don't know. I'm finna hear you can get this on the wall, man. Cause you know we got a game tonight. You hear me? Hey man, get in the comment section. Let me know how y'all think. Hey, what's going on these NBA players? What y'all think about what's, what's, what's going on, man? For real. A lot of balling going on. For real, for real. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people biased to certain teams, but let me know how y'all coming, man. Get this to the crib, though. Fresh off that video too, man, where I put y'all on speed. What's going on with uh with Boosie, man, coming down here to Colleen, Texas, man. Block party thing, you feel me? It's gonna be lit. Um also finesse two times finna slide down here too, man. Uh I think he got a date in June, maybe June or July, but he's supposed to be coming down here to uh Blueprint, which is right down the street as well, though. So it's a new club that just opened up down here in Colleen and uh they making noise, man. Already bringing uh, two times. Check him out. Boat up. Boat up. I don't know, man. We're going to see what's to it, though. But I just caught wind of that, man. I had to share that with y'all, too, though. You know what I'm saying? Being this how I already the, um, dropped the video talking about Boosie coming, man. So if you ain't seen Boosie, man, it's most definitely going to go see Boosie is in it. You know what I'm saying? Um, I hate that uh, the guy that uh, I dropped the TV off to or the guy who actually helped me um, carry the TV from the truck to the store um, wasn't in because they wasn't able to tell me um, anything specific about um, the TV um, based on the conversations that we had already had. But um, the woman who was there, she was of some assistance um, as far as able to get the sale completed. Um, but you see, I had to actually carry the TV myself and um, me and her didn't have a conversation before, so I really couldn't ask her specific questions. But um, She actually subscribed to the channel, so um, I'm glad it worked out. I hope you do get a chance to see yourself on the channel. Uh, things was moving kind of fast the day I actually dropped the TV off, and even faster the day I pick them up. So um, I don't know. Shout out to you, though, bro. I appreciate what y'all doing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I didn't get the woman's name at the uh, at the store. Shout out to you as well, and uh, everybody who been rooting for me, man. Everybody who want positive vibes on this channel to grow. You know what I'm saying? And, all the new people who've been commenting on the videos, I appreciate y'all too, man. We got new people sharing some of the material. And I'm um, gonna continue to be blessed, man, as long as we keep moving the way we moving, man. So, um, shout out to all the whole Go Hard gang out there, man, that's just moving accordingly, you feel me? For real. Let me show y'all blueprint real quick. Go around this bend right here, man. Straight ahead, this club right here is Blueprint. Blueprint actually, was uh if i am mistaken
mistake in the Twice as Funny Lounge. I remember um, when Monique came down here, the comedian, queen of comedy, you know what I'm saying? She came down here and it's most definitely this whole parking lot, everywhere around here. You couldn't even park nowhere because everybody was parked that went to her event all around the back of the building. And uh, man, I, I knew they was on to something, but it's crazy that that place didn't last because you see now it's called Blueprint. And uh, a couple of my clients, you know, they, they, they fall through it on a regular basis, man. So um, they said they got finesse coming in the building, man. I looked it up and uh, man, it's validated, man. So uh, man, we, I'm gonna I'm I'm drive across the street so y'all can see the building. And uh, y'all can be the judge on whether y'all wanna slide through or not, man. But you know, they bringing them out, man. Colleen, Texas, they coming out. I haven't been in here since it's been blueprint i'll be honest with y'all you know y'all see all my videos man i really very rarely ever come outside at night man it's been a long time since your boy done popped out but um and i promise y'all i'm gonna start giving y'all some different content it's coming you feel me oh they gotta come get this trash though you feel me gotta make way for two times before we come through but uh this the spot though man i still got this tv in the back so i ain't gonna be doing too much Saying, but uh, this is it though. Blueprint. And that's the taco truck right there. I think he actually the one that set up shop in this parking lot. I ain't sure, but it do be a taco truck out here most times in this parking lot. So yeah, see how big the parking lot is. They say country rock right there, so I guess that's what something it used to be. They still say twice as funny actually on the door. I can see it right now as I pull towards the front. The, it still says twice as funny on the door. So y'all see it though it's a number on there if you guys want to get in contact with anybody about the building it says it's a comedy lounge still on the door so i don't know if they just ain't changed that or what but this is the place where finesse supposed to be coming so um y'all see it is blue and the name is blueprint so, y'all get them tickets man get in tune Real cautious in this parking lot. I got a lot of dips and bumps and do 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 dooms going on. So, you know what I'm saying? We got precious cargo right here. We ain't playing no games with it. You hear me? But um, they said they do more than just TVs, man. They do refrigerators and pretty much all appliances like outside of gaming, man. So, if y'all need them, man, CSM. Yeah, right there on Stan Sluter. back on this road man they come through crawling you see them jeep light Put it on this wall real quick, just so it's out the way. Yeah, 
handle with care, y'all. So I would hate for y'all to spend that money. Just to get home and break it. Definitely was just a workout. Solo dolo. <laughs> <laughs>